An MMA fighter is fighting for a new mission. His one year old son was killed by a drunk driver. CBS 2's Jeff Nguyen is in Hawthorne to show us how his parents are trying to save lives. This is the mouthpiece I used for my last fight. Mixed martial arts fighter Marcus Koval chose this logo for a nonprofit called Liam'sLife.org. <laughs> As a way to honor his son Liam, seen here with his mom and Koval's wife Michelle Eder. You see, the green frog was Liam's favorite toy. That was the first thing we saw on the street was the, the green frog. Liam was only 15 months old when he was struck and killed by a drunk driver. His aunt was pushing his stroller through a Hawthorne crosswalk exactly two years ago. It's hard. It's a hard day. Donna Marie Higgins was sentenced to six years in prison, but Liam's parents are now pushing to drop the legal blood alcohol content level for driving in California from 0.08 to 0.05. Looking at the numbers for this Labor Day weekend, the CHP reports there were 969 DUI arrests statewide. That's up from 959 a year ago. Sometimes culture changes changes policy, but right now we need the policy to change the culture. Liam's parents say plenty of politicians have listened to their pleas for change, but no one has stepped up. The couple is now raising Nico, who is Liam's little brother. Koval has retired from competition, but he says he has a new fight on his hands, and this tattoo serves as a constant reminder. Ultimately, this fight in Liam's name is to save other children, other families from having to go through what we've gone through. And in many ways, Liam lives on because his organs were donated after he was taken off life support. His foundation is fighting for policy change and his family will honor him during a moment of silence tomorrow at 2 p.m. right here at the crash site. Live in Hawthorne, Jeff Nguyen, CBS2 News.